All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching the World's Finest Assassin episode 12, the finale of the season. I'm super looking forward to the end of this now. Um, hopefully we get a season two announcement very soon if one hasn't already been announced. I'm not sure yet. Um, but yeah, uh, I want to thank you guys so much for watching along with me this season. I really appreciate it and I really appreciate your support on this series. The series really was a surprise to me as it, it was a lot better than I initially thought it was going to be. Um, but yeah, anyway guys, as always, like the video if you liked the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh, this is... Yeah, this is Lou. I just saw the plane. Yeah. I can't believe the first person they didn't bring in as a reincarnation wasn't a assassin to actually kill the hero. I can't believe they tried all that other gimmicky shit first. Yeah. No, he's gonna kill her. No, I'm just, just kidding. <laughs> Bro, this dad's chill as hell. Imagine an actual assassin could have come, but no, it's this guy. Oh, this guy's a beast. Let's go. It's a person. Hey, this could be your son soon, bro. Don't worry. Can she get like a megaphone or something? That's quite far away. Oh shit, what is going on? Wait, is there another assassin? Oh, it's him. What the hell is that? That is not medieval technology. What is this? Bro, holy shit. Is this Kafulin? Or however you say his name? That is not technology or technology of this world. Is this someone else that was reincarnated, or is this just an absolute chat of a man? Bro, this fight is going to be insane. Holy shit. He's straight out, like, brought out the war level magic. <laughs> Assassination. This is war. <laughs> exactly. Oh god, this dude is exuding so much chad energy. Bro, he's a lancer and a berserker? Holy shit. My guy, you don't want to fight this dude. Lou is probably the best chance. Hey Lou, this might be your best chance, bro. Go for it, even a, a duel isn't really an assassin's thing. Yeah, that is usually how berserkers work. This is someone that's been reincarnated, right? Wait, this is the hero? Did she say that back then in that episode? Did I just completely miss that? I thought this was just a really strong dude. What the fuck? Don't mind me just playing my cello alone in my office. Oh, this is the message from Maha? Bro, well, as if I'm, I mean, we're meeting the hero now. I didn't realize we'd be fighting him already. Oh my god. I do not think you're ready to fight the hero yet. Oh, why is he got a massive tungsten missile? What the hell did he just do with that? What is the other skill that this guy has that stops him from going insane right now? Yeah, because it's way too early, right? Bro, there needs to be another option. Didn't he say in the very first episode there was a skill that would be pointless to anybody else, but with his... Kind of his brains, it would be amazing. <laughs> it just gives him a fake name. Okay. I can see why this guy is going to pose a, pro a problem in the future. He is really like stalling for time. That's hilarious. <laughs> Bro, what is going to happen? He like that tungsten missile. I think he threw it. 
He, well, he did indeed have a good upbringing, yeah. The hero hasn't realized that he's stalling like crazy, though. But he's doing an efficient job of it. Surely the goddess isn't going to let him kill him earlier than was required. I think I know. I think I know what Lou's done. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna like wait to see if I was right though. He flipped the hell high. Bro, he's probably timed the exact coin flip to hit the ground when this thing hits. Oh, please don't let there be any twist. Oh my God. Rods from God. I thought he'd thrown it, like... <laughs> it seemed stupid. I thought he'd, like, thrown it and it had gone around the world for some reason. I thought it was going to, like, pierce through him. Wow. Bro, the spells in this show are so interesting. Lou is a genius. <laughs> no fucking way. He's a he's actually a genius. Holy shit. Bro, please say this actually took him down though. So in the last episode when I was talking about oh he's gonna like throw a nuke at them or something. Now he actually has. Well that army that, that was sitting behind that guy's probably gone now. Watch, he, he's like, he's like dodged it or something, I swear. The fact that that was all, it wasn't like one god level spell. It was a, cum a culmination of science and other smaller spells that made that such a god level attack. It's so fucking cool. Where is the hero? This, I, I'd love to believe that that actually took him down in one, but like... It's the hero. He wasn't meant to be killed so soon, right? I don't like this situation. Everything seems too good right now. I mean, Lou clearly put in the work for that. But, like, I don't know. Seems too calculated. I mean, Lou's a genius, but, you know. Ooh. Okay, Lou. Okay. Wait, he failed the assassination attempt? Wait, what, is the hero not dead? Or is it because he killed him too early, or what? Oh, Todd's like, no, Daya came with two. Like, even if the hero actually died there, if that was the hero, like we said, surely his weapon wouldn't have, like, been destroyed there. I don't think, like, a magical weapon on that level would have been destroyed. Oh, he's building an actual gun, cool. The only person that would have been able to do that is Lou. Goddamn. Oh good, another sister that's attracted to him. Wait. Wait, what? That wasn't the hero? Oh my god. That guy was too strong not to be a hero, but I, I, I thought he wasn't the hero. I can't believe that dude died. Lancer died, just as they always do in Fate. Okay, this guy looks way more fitting to be the hero. Oh, anime. All right, so that was the World's Finest Assassin, episode 12, the finale. What an outstanding finale that was. Oh my god, I loved every second of it. That fight was amazing. Lou is a genius, as per usual, with these spell combinations. Like, my god. I knew for I knew it. I knew that wasn't going to be the hero. But the way that Lou took on this guy that was so exceedingly strong was like, it was great practice regardless. Um, what, what we've now actually seen is the real hero makes a lot more sense because what would it be an isekai if the hero didn't look and was shaped like a lot like the protagonist was? I don't know. Um, yeah, definitely seems more on the kind of hero level, you know. Young boy, of course, he's the, the, the hero of the story. Um, but yeah, overall, a very good episode and I'm super excited to see when if there'll be a season two. Presumably there will be because this anime is awesome. And I'm definitely looking forward to that. And like I said, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching along with me. I really appreciate it. And yeah. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.